Hello, everyone. All of are in one body of Christ. Our Savior welcomes you to the state of what has given us together. Today, we will be meditating upon. Are we ready to receive the gift we really need? Before we start, let's see what Scripture talks about in this topic. Isaiah chapter 9, verse 6. For a child is born to us, a son is given to us. The government will rest on his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Now let's see what we can learn from the verse we have just read. During the festives of this season of giving, every one of us waits for someone special to acknowledge us with the love and affection, show us that we truly have some special place in their hearts. We expect something to be given to us by others. Sometimes we fulfill the promise we made to give on this particular day. It could be a something tangible or emotional. We all wait for the time when other will greet us with their kind wishes, affections, and love, showing that they truly care about us and love us. They have a special place for us. Every year, we receive or give so many things to or from others. Next year, we expect something new to receive or give. Why? It's because whatever we give or receive loses its value of or memories that are dimmed down during the course of the year. The first Christmas over 2,000 years ago was all about presents. It was about a gift that came from heaven with your name on it, from God. It wasn't wrapped in expensive red paper and tied with a bow of gold, but it was a gift personally chosen for you just to see. It was a present that God knew you were unable to live without. He knew that this particular gift would change your life forever. The gift has been given, a baby in a manger. The the Bible says that God so loved the world that he gave his only son, his only son. When you love somebody, you just have to give. God loved you enough to give you what you wanted most of all unconditional love and a never-ending song in your heart will you receive heaven's gift this year the gift has already been given and is yours to receive it is the gift of the father to his child it is a gift that will guarantee heaven's entrance into all your circumstances and a gift that will ensure your entrance into the joy of heaven this message also gives us a promise for our day today The promises. But when the set time had fully come, God sent his son, born of a woman, born under the law, to redeem those under the law, that we might receive adoption to sonship. Let's close this time in prayer together. Please join me in this prayer. Dear Lord, Heavenly Father, mighty, wonderful God, Lord, thank you for this wonderful gift I have received even before we took the first breath. You have chosen me to be blessed with the blessings of the gift of eternal life. Thank you for the great love for me. As I celebrate this Christmas, I must acknowledge this gift and tell others about the gift I have received from you. I joyfully tell everyone that I have found a special favor in your eyes, even before my existence. In Jesus' name, I thank you, my God, my Father, with Amen and Amen once again. Have a blessed day, everyone. And if God's willing, we will talk to you tomorrow.